Hi, this is Matt Rezac with Love Hops Farm, and I'm pleased to introduce you to never before seen footage of my do it yourself, minimum viable product, garage scale hops picker. And there's a few different features I want to point out here about the picker. Um, you can see inside there's a number of picking bits, which is what I call them. Uh, as this is my first prototype, a lot of things did not work the way that I thought they would uh, once they were used in the real world. However, I'm happy to say that the picker probably works at least as well, if not a little bit better than I would have expected it to work uh, on the first run here. So we're just going to go ahead and get a bird's eye view here. <laughs> These are the picking tines. Uh, which are connected to uh, an electric motor, which I sourced off of a table saw that I conveniently broke uh, along the way while I was building the hops picker. You can see it's all made out of wood, so it gives it that retro uh, Dutch style styling that is all the rage with hop growers in the United States right now. Down there you can see a bind that is all geared up and ready to be picked. This uh, horizontal crossbar, right, where is it, right here, is what I use to pull the bind over as I lift it up through the uh, machine so the hops can be stripped. For now, I've only just used clamps to secure the motor in place because Again, it being a prototype, a lot of adjustments uh, needed to happen uh, when I was first using it. <clears throat> Here's a little side view. These other picking bits really are there, uh, what are they? To intimidate the binds, I think. The chains are added purely for the aesthetic pleasure of giving it a little bit more of an industrial look. And we'll zoom out here and come around. Here you can see there's a bunch of 2015 year one and two Columbus hops that I'll be picking this afternoon. Uh, the hops enter through this garbage bag that's been sliced as sort of an entry porthole. And then down here, you have a waxed tablecloth um, which is used as kind of a sorter, although honestly I didn't have a chance to develop that idea very far. And then all of a sudden it was time to pick hops. So uh, that part doesn't really work. It's something I can work on over the winter. So I'll stop for now and in a minute I'll cut in and we'll see the hops picker at work. Mm -hmm. 